hi and hello to you. This is just a quick tip for you. Let's say you're trying to make a UI element, like you're trying to make a dialog box, you're trying to make a menu, trying to make, you know, something that the user would interact with, a control node, if you will. And you've got this, and it's gray, and it's kind of doo-doo. You can go in here and change the color. That's fine, but you've seen in video games these really nice borders around their UI elements, and you want that life. You want those really nice borders around your UI elements. You can do that. It's pretty easy once you know how. So you go online or you go in a sprite and you make yourself something and you get it and it looks like this. That looks like a Mario block. How in the world do you make this? Bye. Sorry. There we go look like this one of those easy once you know how things so I've got a panel right here this by the way works if you're doing it in theme too I'm gonna go to theme override styles and it's gonna say panel but it's empty I want it to have a new style box texture don't worry we'll fix it click the word style box texture where it's got the rainbow and all this and now you've got options. I'm going to drag in that texture into the texture hole. And you're like, uh, that still looks like trash. Come to the texture margins. You want to adjust the texture margins. They're the white lines here. You want to adjust them so that they kind of barely graze the middle. I'll show you. Because I made this one, I know that it's 24 all around. If you didn't make it or you did make it it may not be 24 you may have to experiment but if you get it right it looks like this and Godot will scale that for you huh huh so like maybe your menu is this wide maybe your menu is really long the engine knows to make that the size that you're trying to tell it another cool trick Let's, I'm going to right click on this and I'm going to change it to a panel container. It still works the same. Boop, 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 boop. I'm going to set it really small and as a child, I'm going to add a label. Putting text in this wouldn't be too weird, would it? But it does scale to any text that I put in it. It'll really scale to any UI element that I put in it. Let me prove it to you. The box. Make the label a child of the VBox container. Let's throw a few buttons in there. Button, that button needs some text. See, it scales. Very nice. I hope this helped you out. You have a good one. Take it easy, and I will see you next time. Mm -hmm.